is a thousand monkeys working in a thousand typewriters. Soon, they'll have written the greatest novel known to man. Let's see. It was the best of times. It was the blurst of times. You stupid monkey. <laughs> oh, shut up. Smithers, what's the meaning of this slacking off? Uh, there's a bee in my eye, sir. And? Uh, I- I'm allergic to bee stings. They, they cause me to, uh, die. But we're running out of forward momentum. Uh, perhaps you could paddle for just a little while, sir. Quite impossible. I can try to bat him off if you like. Uh, <clears throat> really, that's okay. <clears throat> Come on, stay yellow, stay yellow! Man, I'm making record time. If only I had some place to be. <clears throat> oh, you gods! My roast is ruined! What if I were to purchase fast food and disguise it as my own cooking? <laughs> Delightfully devilish, Seymour. Hello, you can't just sit there watching TV all day. You know, you're right. I should do a little reading. Uh, you got any of those uh, Where's Waldo books? No. Hmm. Well, how about anything written from the vampire's point of view? No. Well, how about anything where guys send in naked pictures of their chicks? Otto, I think you should get a job. Look, the only thing I was ever good at was driving a bus. Now the man says I need a piece of paper to do that. So get that piece of paper. I tried. Oh, Lord, how I did try. <sighs> 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 Oh, now calm down, Italy, diddly, 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 diddly. They did their best, shoddily, Italy, Italy, diddly. Gotta be nice, hostility, diddly, diddly, diddly. Ah, hell, diddly, ding, dong, crap! Can't you morons do anything right? And the very same goes for Ezekiel, which brings us back to our starting point, the nine tenets of constancy. Uh. Damn it! <laughs> well, I seem to have lost my place. So I'll start over. We're just about to get our first pictures from inside the spacecraft with average, not Homer Simpson. And we'd like to... Ah! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, uh, we've just lost the picture, but uh, what we've seen speaks for itself. The Corvair spacecraft has apparently been taken over, conquered, if you will, by a master race of giant space ants. It's difficult to tell from this vantage point whether they will consume the captive Earthmen or merely enslave them. One thing is for certain, there is no stopping them. The ants will soon be here. And I, for one, welcome our new insect overlords. I'd like to remind them that as a trusted TV personality, uh, I can be helpful in rounding up others to toil in their underground sugar caves. Young man, there's nothing funny about novelties. <laughs> I mean, they're humorous and all, but uh, this is certainly no laughing matter. (laughs) Can you help him, Doctor? Oh, my, yes. Why, if I had $75 for every novelty I've removed... Oh, by the way, I'll need to check for $75. Yes, I think a a series of painful injections directly into Bart's spine should get the job done. Did you ever notice how men always leave the toilet seat up? That's the joke. You suck, McBain! Now, my Woody Allen impression. I'm a neurotic nerd who likes to sleep with little girls. Hey, that really sucked! Uh, Why are you laughing? Hey, you're laughing at your pain! That's me. Let's teach him a lesson. Talking on a turn. That's a paddling. Looking out the window. That's a paddling. Staring at my sandals. That's a paddling. Paddling the school canoe. Oh, you better believe that's a paddling. Uh, well, I'm back from vacation. But I was just about to bang my gavel, making the sentence official. Sorry, I've already put my clown down. But I was just going the to... The clown is down. Oh! Judge Snyder, motion to declare a writ of boys will be boys. Motion granted. Case dismissed. Strategy. Hmm. How many men do you have? None. You'll need more. 
And you'll need to train them hard. Now, let's see. <clears throat> okay. The key to Springfield has always been Elm Street. The Greeks knew it. The Carthaginians knew it. Now you know it. Silence! We are travelers from a certain nearby ringed planet whose name we'd prefer not to mention. My name is Kang. And this is my sister, Kodos. Hello. I suppose you want to probe me. Well, might as well get it over with. Stop. We have reached the limits of what rectal probing can teach us. Miss Simpson, do you find something funny about the word tromboner? No, sir. I was laughing at something outside. She was looking at Nelson. Lisa likes Nelson. She does not. Millhouse likes Lisa. He does not. Jamie likes Millhouse. She does not. Una likes Millhouse. Nobody likes Millhouse. Lisa, you've got detention. People see movies like McBain and they think it's all bang, bang, shoot em up, cops and robbers. Let's roll. One ocean tango. We are in pursuit of a speeding individual driving a red car. License number eggplant Xerxes crybaby overbite narwhal. I wish you'd come to my party, Apu. You could use some merriment. Listen, serving the customer is merriment enough for me. Thank you. Come again. You see? Most enjoyable. Oh, I guarantee it. Wing ding of titanic proportions. You will be there or can be B square. Everyone comfy? <laughs> Good. Now. Don't touch any of those buttons in front of you for a very important reason, i.e., you are wired into the rest of your family. You have the ability to shock them, and they have the ability to shock... Ah! Testing. Why oh, you? Oh, not yet. Oh. <laughs> you see, this is what is known as aversion therapy. When someone hurts you emotionally, you will hurt them physically, and gradually you will learn not to hurt each other at all. And won't that be wonderful, Homer? Oh, yes, Doctor. Oh! I think what we have in our hands here is a classic case of what laymen refer to as fear of failure. As a result, Bart is an underachiever, and yet he seems to be... How shall I put this? Proud of it? Mmm. One of his problems may be his short attention span, which can lead to... Blah, 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 bl